Hey YouTube, it's Erin and I am the Handbag Housewife and I'm back again with another video. Today is going to be the teeniest, tiniest unboxing you ever did see. What's in this little bag is small but mighty and I can't wait to show you and I can't wait to show you what it goes with. This is not a gift. I bought this with my own money. Actually, Macy sent me some rewards money based on some previous purchases, so I guess that could be considered a gift, but I had to spend money to get it. Let's just see what's in here, and then I'll show you what it goes with. I don't even need my handy-dandy ceramic knife to get into this package. I'm just going to whip what's inside right out. Let's whip it into shape. Ship it up get it straight let's whip it got a little coach yay you know i love my coach oh my gosh this is teeny teeny so what fell out a little some sort of a little card this is so small i seriously thought this was bigger okay so guys this is where it pays to read the description box yes this is the smallest charm I ever did see. I mean, it is so freaking tiny, <gasps> but it, it did get better. It did get better as I pulled the wrapping off because at first the charm was overlapping this. So all I saw was the cherries and I didn't even think that it would be long enough to do anything with, but this tiny little cherries charm Get a nice good view for you guys way up close. Looks like it has a little rhinestone right there on the top. I can't tell with without my glasses on, but I have had one of these in the past and it did have a rhinestone right there. So it may, again, I can't tell because I can't see good enough to tell. You guys know based on my Cassie collection videos and I will link my old one as well as my newest one down in the description box because there is a lot of change with the bags over time, including with what I decorate them with. And so you might wanna watch both videos if you haven't seen them. Of course, the second video has mostly the same bags as the first video, just fewer of them. But because I sold some of the bags, I took the decorations off of those bags and kind of redistributed them throughout my collection, plus added new decor and chains, etc. So you might have fun watching both. So I'm going to go ahead and take this little tiny, teeny charm off of this tiny, teeny card. If I can get, oh my gosh, I may have to cut it off. I'm going to have to cut it off. My fingernails are too thick. <laughs> That's what you get for doing your own nails. Um, they're too thick to get underneath the little part that holds this on. Oh my goodness, guys, look how tiny that is. I think it's green on this side. The side I showed you, it was just all gold. That makes it even better. Okay, I'm gonna have to put my glasses on to see what I'm doing. So I have this little hang tag on here. It is shrink tubed on and so I can remove the shrink <laughs> I can remove the shrink tube if I have to, but I'd rather not. So I'm going to see if I can clip this because it has a little clip. And I'm thinking I can as long as I go in between two of the balls. That's what she said, right, Winnie? You just have to be really careful when you're going in between the balls not to put too much strain on this little clip because if you do, the clip will break. I have done that before. That was not a good day. Um, wow, this is a, a challenging endeavor. Let's just say, okay, I've got it pulled back. I got it, yay! Okay, so I have had a chance to look at more than one of these Cassies. And I believe that the pattern is the same on all of them, including on the hang tag. And if you look right there, look where that beautiful little charm falls amongst the pattern. The pattern was just put around the edges on these hang tags on both sides. So if you wanted to, I think you could put a hot stamp in the middle. And that's why I think that they did it that way but I wanted to put a little dangly thing of cherries in the middle to go on my cherry bag. And isn't that just the cutest thing that you ever did see? 
I'm loving it. Guys, I'm loving it. Cherries, cherries, and more cherries. Oh, I love it so much. Mmm, so cute. And guys, this charm is $35, and it does not have a little diamond thingy on it like I thought. Oh, wait, it does. The diamond thingy is on the side that the cherries are all gold. The side that the cherries are green, the diamond thingy isn't. So if I wanted to get rid of the green leaves, I would have a crystal. So what I'm saying to you is it's reversible. Let me just see if I can reverse it. So I loved it with the green, but I think I like it with a little crystal and then the gold leaves even just a tiny bit better because there's no green on my bag. What do you guys think? I think that that is just pretty darn cute. And I like that it's reversible. And the leaf on the charm even has a little line down the middle of it on the gold side. So it's really like it was meant to go that way, but it gives you the option to have it on the green side too. Well, that is my cherries charm on my Cassie cherry, my cherry Cassie, my Cassie with cherries, whatever it is. If you like content like this, please give me a big thumbs up. I know I'm being a goofball today, but I really didn't want to do a video, so I figured I will just make it a fun, short, little sweet video, and it's just going to be sweet like cherries. So give me a thumbs up. If you haven't found me on Instagram yet, go do that. It's the at symbol, then the handbag housewife, all lowercase in the search bar. You can DM me there, or you can email me at the handbag housewife at gmail.com. If you're not already, start having a fabulous day, and I will see you real soon. Bye.